Hello YouTube. I am presenting you my custom PCB. I made for my OLED displays. Um, they originally come in a nine piece design. I can use them as a six way display like I have here. I will show you in a second. I can use it as a four display, three, two or one. Okay, let me show you first my cube clock. Well, it shows the clock, the time, room temperature from the DS3231 RTC module. And it does show here real time voltage of the lithium ion battery. I just freshly, f sorry, freshly charged it, so that's why it shows 4.25 volts. This display works to about 3 volts, down to 3 volts. I will also incorporate the LiPo charger module. If I get it to focus, I show you. You get these on eBay for cheap. I didn't have to make this myself. This will eventually go inside here. There is still room. Okay, so this is the clock. And I have a GPS module, which is here. It's just showing the time right now. It's connected to my portable mini Holux GPS, which is this guy here. I bought this over 10 years ago. <laughs> it works with Bluetooth also. That's why the Bluetooth sign is blinking here, the blue one. But I connected it through its micro, no, mini USB cable to my module here. And I'll show you the screens now on the GPS. This is the main screen. It shows you the height in meters, satellites acquired speed in kilometers, time and the date on the bottom. Oh, my cats are making trouble out there. The second screen is a trip distance, not a trip, a uh, distance to saved position. I can save the position by pulling this button here for three seconds. Now it's saved the coordinates down here. The other coordinates are the same, of course. I'm zero meters from the coordinates. This is a trip summary. You can see the last time I traveled was two kilometers and 556 meters. The raw data is just the same thing up there. That's gonna be changed and the satellites acquired again. And this is the watch. You can change it also into 12 hour modes. Uh, you can see the PM and the 12 hour mode. And then back to 24 hours. And then you come back to the main screen. Here you can also change. Here you see it's in uh, letters. And you can s change it in degrees. Okay, so this is my small GPS. And this is my six screen display. Right now it's running on a battery for testing purposes. And if I switch the battery, if I connect it, you can see the startup sequence. Those three programs on the top are essentially the same, only starting with the different screen settings. The kilometers, RPM, they are flickering because they are not connected to anything, so... Yeah, I can show you it's kilometers. You have an acceleration from 0 to 60 counter. You have the RPM. You have oil pressure and water temperature. 
you have oil temperature and battery voltage it's obviously not correct right now it's not connected and you have an outside temperature gauge also in here and then you get the trip again this one is essentially the same voltmeter as on this little guy here only here it is a standalone application and those are the fuel gauge and the coolant temperature and this will go in a case obviously and we'll get the wires connected to it this is not the final setup I can change anything I want here on the displays it is essentially a six times Arduino at mega chip on here so the programs run in individually and you can show whatever you like I will be putting these up for sale on eBay and on Tindy and uh, I will be selling them as probably bare PCB as a PCB with a mega chip already installed with, with a bootloader and as a PCB with the OLED screen on it and obviously you can order them in one I do have a double in two piece configuration three four six or nine you can of course pull them together in any other configuration like this for example or whatever well this is it I hope I have you interested in it and I hope to see you soon again take care and thanks for watching